G'day campers, Justin the Wayward Aussie. I'm actually here at 230's head office today and I want you to walk through with me the Armadillo A. Now this is a side open hard shell tent and we call it an Armadillo A because it's an aluminum shell. So it's not a plastic shell, this one's actually hand formed, custom built just for us, aluminum shape. It tapers down at the front and then you have a look at the top, it's got some mounting rails on the top. So you can mount things like recovery boards, solar panels, maybe some light bags and bits and pieces. So you could even put some bikes up there if you wanted to, but just be careful, too much weight means it's gonna get a little bit harder to open, but it's built to actually put some stuff up there. Um, some of the things you see that we really tried to do with the Armadillo series in the A especially, was to keep some of the features that we've learned that you guys like from our current models. So rather than just do one model of tent, we've now got 15 different models of tent. And there's some things that we've found that you guys like that we've kept inside of this. One of those things is these huge windows. So you'll see that it's not just a little tiny square, it's not a single flap, you can open it up using the color coded spring rods, black for the sides, red for the front. You can open up this big window, massive big screen inside there, and then inside you can open the LST flap, light suppression, so that's another one of those things, we'll get to that in a minute. Um, really keeps that window nice and big, gets that airflow going through. So come on inside, and we're gonna show you some of the bits on the inside of the tent that really makes this thing special. So, first thing you're gonna see is that even with the lights on, this comes with a light that's already pre-installed inside, um, it's still pretty dark even though it's inside our showroom. That's because the LST, light suppression technology, is actually doing its job really well. Um, we have a quilted mattress, we have a quilted roof. Um, you can see the size of those windows now from the inside. We're gonna zoom in on that so you get a bit of a look. Um, so that means that you can control how much light's inside the tent by those two. And you'll notice at the back there, and when we climb inside, there's an extra six or seven inches of space where the lid actually comes off to actually put more gear at the other end. So that makes this tent feel really big, even though that we call it a two person. And inside, width wise, it's only about 56 inches. So it's about the size of a double bed. So um, let's go through and have a look at some of the other small features that we've got that comes with the tent as standard. We have anti rattle zippers. So they're not jingly, jingly, jingly too much. It comes with boot bags. So you've got on one side, boot bags. And then on the other side, there's a gear pocket for keys and phones and wallets and all that other stuff that you really don't want to take into the tent if you don't need to. I mentioned before, the spring rods are color coded. Red are for the front, black are for the two sides. You'll see now we've got these two little side windows. This is so you can get some airflow and crossflow ventilation. Uh, for you guys playing at home, and I know there's uh, lots of questions being asked on this tent, you'll notice there's a zipper on this edge. Now it's not here yet, but in the next few weeks, hopefully we're gonna start to see the annexes for this tent turn up. So just keep an eye on that. So it's not far away, but that's why that zipper's actually there. So the question's asked, does it have an annex? No, not yet, but soon. Just be patient, it looks really good. So that's the Armadillo A. If you've got any more questions on this, jump on our website at 230.com, look up Armadillo A, two or three, and that will give you the rest of the details. Thanks for visiting.